Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great Class A motorhome value from Parkway RV Center. Folks, we just got in an extremely nice 2008 Winnebago Sonova. This is a model number 35J, two slide outs, only 20,000 miles. And what's the nice thing about it, folks, it's a very rare bunkhouse Class A floor plan. Something you, you see in one out of 50 Class A's. Uh, folks, this unit very nice, very clean. I've got the original window sticker in there. It cost $115,000 new. This unit's got 20,000 miles on it. 5,500 watt Onan generator that runs great. Of course, Winnebago, as many of you know, I own one myself. I've owned two of them. The reason I bought Winnebago or other brands is because Winnebago is the only manufacturer that actually builds 80% of their own parts. Other manufacturers buy all aftermarket parts and just assemble them. That's why when you get a other another brand of a motorhome and it gets four or five years old, you can't hardly get parts for it from the factory because they're all aftermarket. And these aftermarket parts companies go in and out of business like crazy. But no, folks, this is a Winnebago who actually builds 80% of their own parts. They are the only manufacturer that actually builds their own frames in-house. They weren't happy with the with these kind of frames and the quality they were getting from the vendors so they started building their own frame shop all of metal frames they ha even have their own slide system built just for Winnebago products another nice feature folks is that this is a fiberglass roof no maintenance you don't have to worry about going up there and sealing it every year and doing your yearly service on it just you know, you might want to go up there and do every year or so, just caulk around the stuff that's stuck through the roof like antennas and skylights. But other than that, folks, no expensive maintenance like you do with a rubber roof. This is a two slider. They both slides have awning toppers. Got the 305 horsepower, 6.8 liter Triton V10. Four Seasons model, well insulated for year-round use. Of course, I love these newer front ends on these 08s, folks. Big windshield, so you don't miss anything when you're driving. I'm going to tell you, for an 08 model, this is a nice motorhome. Of course, Winnebago's exclusive. Store and more slide-out system, where the actual bays come out with the slide, so easy to get in there without banging your head on the slide-out. 5,500 watt Onan Marquee Gold generator running both air conditioners and everything else with no problem. Tires look great. I'm going to tell you folks, for this year model motorhome, and considering how much money you're saving, this is a nice, this is a nice RV for what it is. It's still used, but it's a nice motorhome. 20,000 miles, I've got it for $49.9, and that includes up to 138 point inspection by our certified RV technicians and a 90-day nationwide limited warranty, all included for under $50,000. Now folks, compare that to $115,000 new. I don't know about you, but if I just paid 115 grand for one of these, drove by a used lot and seen one just like it with 20,000 miles for under 50, I would just be absolutely sick. But that's exactly what's happened. Awnings in great shape, power steps. Let's take a look inside this Winnebago Sonova. As you can see, the steps work great. Now, folks, as we step inside, there's no smoke or pad odors. And like I said, after purchase, my RV techs will perform up to 138 point inspection. Make sure all, everything on that inspection works, which covers pretty much everything mechanical on it. And if you would like a copy of that inspection report, a blank one, to see what all we check out, what all we cover, just give us a call, get one of our non-commissioned salespeople or email us, I'll be happy to send you a copy via email or fax. 20,606 miles, no check engine lights, no ABS lights, three camera backup system, Jensen audio system, power gear, hydraulic jacks, heated power mirrors, Winnebago builds their own furniture. This is all Winnebago furniture. And the advantage of, buy, of buying from a company, folks, I forgot to mention this earlier. 
The advantage from buying from a company that builds 80% of the parts is that you can get parts for in, just about any Winnebago all the way back to 1968. So if this, when this unit gets 20 years old, 30 years old, you need a part, chances are you can still get it right from Winnebago and you can order directly from the factory. All leather furniture, the leather captain's chairs was an upgrade on the window sticker when it was new. Doesn't have a lot of carpet, I like that, especially considering you're getting a bunkhouse, so that means you're going to have kids. Carpet in the cab, a little bit in the bedroom, but the main traffic area is all vinyl, very easy to clean. Leather sleeper sofa, overhead storage, double ducted airs, which does a great job cooling this RV. Nice countertops, residential style double basin sink. Microwave confection oven, which is a nice upgrade, plus your regular LP oven. I put one of these in mine, folks. I'm going to tell you, I, I won't ever own a motorhome without one of these confection ovens. It's nice being able to cook with two ovens or just heat up some biscuits or cornbread or, or whatever you want to fix in the oven without having to light a gas oven. Got a two-way RV refrigerator freezer. You know, Winnebago's crowned roof system. And, of course, everybody's a... Uh, one thing they're known for is the strength of their roofs. And if you don't believe me, just do what I did. I know it seems kind of silly. Next time you're looking at RVs, you go into Winnebago, punch the roof hard, hard as you can. Then go into another brand and punch the roof. When you go into another brand and do what I just did to this Winnebago, you're going to hear rattles, squeaks. Sometimes you'll even see light lenses pop out of the pop out of the ceiling lights because they just aren't built near as sturdy as a Winnebago roof. And a lot of people look at me like I'm crazy when I say that, but the people who've done it, they know exactly what I'm talking about. The difference between a Winnebago roof and just about anything out there is pretty, uh, pretty evident first time you punch it. But folks, now, this is a 2008 model. Now folks, I've, I've had some issues with this lately. Folks, these are used motorhomes, um, and, I, I'm, and I hate to go on and preach like this, but we, you can't make a nine-year-old motorhome brand new at any price. This thing was new once in 2008 for $115,000. It never will be again. Now, we go through our inspection, and that inspection covers pretty much all the mechanical, the plumbing, the electrical, appliances, anything that costs you a lot of money. Now, it does not cover nicks, dings, wear and tear, stuff like that that you get. That's just part of buying a nine-year-old motorhome. For example, round this slide out, they... The, the right here you notice it's got a little boogered up spots from where they've set the bed up and down over the years folks we can't fix that that is just part of buying a nine-year-old motorhome that's why it's sixty-five thousand dollars less than what it cost new just a few years ago with only twenty thousand miles but that's part of it folks that's the downside of it we'll make sure everything works on that list but like I said, if it's got a little scratch here, a nick here, a little worn spot here, that, you know, we can't make them new for what we sell them for. There's no way, no how. So that's just part of it. Now, for those of you, and, and we've had issues with this, people coming in buying 12, 13-year-old motorhomes, expecting them to still have the plastic on them from the factory because they're supposed to be brand new. They're not, folks. You know, these are, these. it's like buying a 2008 model car, truck, SUV, motorcycle boat it's going to have use on it it's going to show use on it that's part of buying a used motorhome you know the if you don't like that then the only thing you can do is go spend over twice as much buy you a brand new 2017 model it's going to look just like this in a few years except you're going to have a lot more money in it so i just want to clear that folks this is a used motorhome it's not perfect None of them are. There's no such thing as a perfect used motorhome. There's no such thing as new condition in a used RV. It's just not possible, folks. So keep that in mind anytime you look here or anywhere else in the country. I don't care how much the RV's priced. It's not new. It's used. I could put $115,000 on it, folks, and advertise it for what it costs brand new, and it would still be a used motorhome with wear and tear on it. That's just part of it. But, folks... $49.9, that's an absolute bargain. If you need to borrow money, we can get up to 180 month financing with interest rates as low as 3%. And let me tell you something, folks. We save you a lot of money on these things. When you go look at these this same motorhome at other dealers on the internet and in person, you're going to see our prices are way, way less 
In any other dealer you go to, a 2008 model is sold as is, no warranty. We give you a 90-day nationwide warranty through CoachNet, which is one of the premier underwriters of aftermarket service contracts. But folks, let's continue on with the tour. Two bunk beds, very unusual for a Class A. Really nice, you got privacy curtains. You could probably hang a little TV up there at the end. You got TV hookups. Back bedroom, master bedroom, King Island bed instead of a queen, which is nice. Got HD TVs in the uh, front and the back. Big closets. Ooh, that air feels good back here, folks. Got his and her nightstands, overhead storage, accent lighting. Got a private bathroom right here, all in the side, which I like. This way, when you're in the restroom getting ready, you're not blocking access to any part of the RV. Stand-up shower, skylight, no water stains, anything like that around the skylight. Got a sink upgrade porcelain RV toilet which is a definite must with kids and everything's enclosed on the side Coleman mock air conditioners or excuse me Coleman Mac I'm used to the old school way of saying it nice motorhome folks is $49.9 for the year model and the price this thing is a great buy for someone this is something you can afford to drive for a couple years and if you want to change and your needs change, you can turn around and get your 49.9 back out of it. It's, it's going to be worth this for the next year or two. And folks, this thing brand new. And here's the window sticker. And I just so you know I'm not blowing smoke up your butt. Two thousand eight Sonova. $115,113. The jacks were a thirty six hundred forty dollar option. It's got the optional dual pane windows, which is almost $1,100. And the seats in the front were $1,400 for the leather seats over the cloth. Folks, nice motorhome, price to sell, $49.9 with warranty, will trade. Give us a call, 706-965-7929. Evenings and Sundays, 423-605-6747. Our website is parkwayrvcenter.com. Folks, let me tell you something. Our rates are so low because we don't mark interest rates up. Other dealers have learned to make thousands of dollars off financing by marking the interest rates up over what the dealers get you approved for. Prime example, our, um, our interest rates start as low as 3%. When I was looking through the paperwork in this one, folks, it was a, uh, it was, I found a, a contract from where the previous owners financed this thing. Now, they weren't the original owners. They bought it used. They financed $65,000, and I think they paid, according to the security contract, ten or $15,000 down. So they paid right at $80,000 for this thing a year and a half ago. Folks, let me tell you something. This is how much money we can save you on interest rate. They went through Navy Federal Credit Union, who I'm very familiar with. Navy, they paid 9% interest rate. Now, folks, the only way Navy, Navy Credit does not have an interest rate that high. What it is, they probably got approved for around 4%, 4.5%, which is about their average rate. The dealer doubled that rate and charged them 9%. And it's right there on the security contract. I was going to show it in the video, folks, but it's got a lot of personal information. I've got a wide out, but... I will show you that contract when you come here in person to look at it. And you can see for yourself how much more in interest other dealers charge. Double the rate, 9%, folks. Crazy. But we can get you done with a finance rate as low as 3% with approved credit. And that's where it starts at, folks. Of course, not everybody can get 3%, but we get several buyers a week. If you've got, you know, 740, 730, 720, uh, credit score, good debt to income ratio, you could probably get 3%. But folks, we save you a lot of money. We save you thousands of dollars on financing because you're not paying higher interest rates because the dealer marked the rate up, which costs you thousands of dollars over the life of an RV loan. I mean, heck folks, double your interest rate. That's 
I wouldn't be surprised that was $10,000 more in interest they pay over the life of the RV loan. We can get you up to 15 year financing with approved credit, very low rates. We don't have extra fees. You know, you go to these other RV dealerships that have this same motor home for $59,000 and $62,000 and $65,000 like they're listed for online without a warranty. What they don't tell you is when you go in there and you say you're going to write a check for it, well, guess what, folks? That advertised price just went up. Uh, they're going to start adding on fees. $800 dock fee. $1,200 prep fee. $2,100 freight fee. Which is what they charge you for them bringing it in from wherever they got it from. They charge you a processing fee, a tag fee, a temp tag fee, a title fee. Before you know it, you're paying five or six thousand dollars in fees, folks, and all those fees are 100% dealer profit. They're 100% unnecessary to purchase a used or even a brand new motorhome. Don't fall victim to them. It's a scam. It's a way for dealers to make more profit and keep their advertised prices low because they don't tell people about those fees until they get ready to close. And then they got a song and dance on why they charge them and what they go to. But folks, don't let them lie to you. It's all profit, all unnecessary. And um, if you pay them, folks, they ripped you off. At Parkway RV Center, all of our prices are out the door plus sales tax. This unit is $49.9. That's out the door. You'll pay sales tax if you're a Georgia resident since we're a Georgia RV dealer. All out-of-state customers will pay their own sales tax when they title this motorhome at their local at their local county DMV in their home state. We give you a 45 day drive out tag. Good anywhere in the country, no charge. We, you get a complete inspection by one of our certified RV techs, uh, up to 138 points, all included for the price. You get a personalized walkthrough by one of our RV techs, again, included at that price. You get starter kit with all your hoses, chemicals, everything you need to take it to the campground besides food clothes and yourself included plus even instructional dvds too in case you have any questions on the road folks i'm gonna tell you um we try to make it as painless as possible we've been around for over 48 years we average over five to six hundred used rv sales a year We've been, we're one of the oldest and most successful and largest independently owned used RV dealerships in the country. We have over 170 plus used RVs in stock. We have more in stock used inventory than any RV dealer within a 500 mile radius of Ringgold, Georgia. And if you want to come here and look, folks, we don't have commissioned salespeople. All of our salespeople are salary based only. There's no sales pressure, no games, no gimmicks. Just savings and actual salespeople who want to work for you instead of against you. Let me tell you something. You never want to buy from a commission salesperson. Unfortunately, most RV dealers use commission salespeople. And let me kind of give you a, an idea why. A commission salesperson doesn't get paid by the hour, they don't get paid by salary. They only get paid when they produce a sale. This allows a RV dealership to keep as many salespeople as they want on hand because it doesn't cost them anything to have those extra salespeople because they only pay them when they produce results. Most lots our size have 25 to 30 RV salespeople. Makes it very competitive because they know they may only talk to one or two people a week. And when that happens, you know, the worst thing that when they, when you when you're the only up they get for the week, the worst thing that you can tell one of them is that you're just looking or you're not ready to buy yet. Because then it suddenly becomes their mission to make you want to buy, to talk you into buying, even if you're not ready, because they know if you don't buy from them, all the time they spent with you is wasted. That's why these commission salespeople do all this crap like a high pressure sales tactics, turnovers. Uh, we either turn you over to a closer, four squares, you know, like car dealers do, where they write everything down on a four square when they start negotiating. That's just to maximize profit because you don't realize it, folks, but the average commission rate for a used or new RV salesperson is 25% of the gross profit. So basically, the dealership is rewarding the salesperson because they, the more money that the salesperson makes the dealership, the more they get paid. 
So that means the RV dealer has to mark their units up an additional 25%, causing their prices to go up to cover the salesperson's commission. So you're not, they're not paying their salespeople. You are by paying thousands more for the same RV you can buy here for thousands less. That's why when you Google 2008 Sonova 35J, you're going to see them for 64, 65, as high as $72,000 for this same make and model with more miles without a warranty plus thousands of dollars in fees when we can sell you this one with no fees, warranty, inspection, everything for $49.9 because we don't use commission salespeople so we don't have that high markup to cover their commission. And plus folks when it comes to dealing with a commission salesperson they're going to try to squeeze every drop of you out of you that they can because every extra dollar they get you to pay is an extra 25 cents in their pocket so of course they're going to try to get you for everything they can and it's just a scam folks just like the rv dealers finance departments folks they're, they're scam artists like i said they get paid by marking the interest rate up over what the bank approves you for costing you thousands of dollars in higher rv payments and they do it every single day multiple times a day that's how they get paid the finance manager just like a commission salesperson gets paid gets paid a huge percentage of how much they make the dealership on what they call back-end products, which is financing, gap insurance, uh, a profit on exterior and interior protection packages, which you know, folks, don't ever buy any of that stuff from a dealer because they're going to mark it up four or five times, which you can go on the Internet and buy it for yourself because they, again, they're marking that stuff up to make profit. And that's why so many people are riding around in late model RVs that they bought from these corporate dealerships and they owe 25, 30 grand more than the retail value of their motorhome because of all those extra fees and, and services that aren't worth the paper they're written on. They talked them into buying. I mean, these guys are good. You know, if you have to buy from a corporate dealer, of course, you're going to pay a lot more for the same unit than you can buy it from here for. But I always recommend getting your own financing. Don't even go through their finance department. They'll try to talk you into it, promise you rebates and all this stuff. But folks, you're money ahead if you don't. Well, you know, folks, it's a nice unit. Sleeps up to eight people, which is a sleeping capacity of a class of C. 20,000 miles. Give us a call, 706-965-7929. We offer nationwide delivery at cost. You pay whatever it costs us to bring this motor home to you, get my driver back home. If you want to come fly in, drive this RV home, that's fine. Call ahead, make arrangements with the salesperson. We'll even pick you up for free at the Chattanooga, Tennessee airport during business hours. If you want to rent a car to get to us, well, again, no charge during business hours. We'll help you drop the car off at our local rental car terminal. If you want to drive your own car and tow it back, we offer tow dollies brand new at dealer cost. We don't sell towed always to the general public. We only sell them to people who buy motorhomes from us. And we can sell you a brand new towed ollie a lot of times for just a little bit more or about the same as you're going to pay for a used one on Craigslist. So give us a call. Email us at sales at Parkway RV Center. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. Folks, I post videos every day and you never know what you're going to see here from one day to the next. Uh, ParkwayRVCenter.com is the username. Of course, you're on the YouTube video now, so you can just click on it and hit subscribe, or you can go to the home page of our website and hit subscribe. Uh, 170 plus RVs in stock at the lowest prices on the internet, 48 years in business, tens of thousands of motorhomes, campers, and fifth wheels sold nationwide and beyond. That's Parkway RV Center. Give us a call, drop us an email. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.